Hello everyone, and welcome to my bold and beautiful today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Luna's gestation problem, Lee pushes to repeal baby? The bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that Luna Nozawa is madly in love with RJ Forrester. Still, after ingesting Poppy Nozawa's magical mints, Luna accidentally slept with Zen Forrester Dominguez. Luna might end up pregnant. Rather than admit to the complicated gestation situation, she could end up going to the sanitarium. Dr. Lee Finnegan could intermediate and push Luna to get an revocation. The bold and the beautiful spoilers, RJ Forrester's perfect romance BNB spoilers reveal that RJ and Luna feel to have the perfect love. Well, at least until Zen started trying to get close to Luna. Everyone seems to adore Luna, with the exception of Lee, who doesn't indeed know her bastard. Indeed Ridge Forrester and Brooke Logan are gaga over Luna. Not to mention that Eric Forrester and Donna Logan both feel to love Luna as well. The bold and the beautiful spoilers Luna's gestation problem, Lee pushes, to repeal baby? BNB spoilers, Poppy Nozawa's capsules unfortunately, Luna's perfect love has been shattered by Poppy's magical mints. Poppy has been taking these mints, but no bone. Is exactly sure what they are. Poppy swore to Lee that it wasn't like it was ahead. So, that suggests that Poppy's magical mints have been a problem for numerous times. While Luna knows her mama has these mints, she's ignorant that they aren't breath mints, but commodity differently. So, when Luna started dating RJ, she started getting paranoid about bad breath. At Eric and Donna's marriage, Luna didn't suppose anything of popping a many mints in her mouth. Unfortunately, those mints led to Luna sleeping with Zend allowing he was RJ. The bold and the beautiful spoilers, Luna Nozawa's gestation problem, the bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that love triangles generally affect in a gestation. So, with Luna sleeping with both RJ and Zend, it's only a matter of time before a gestation pops up. That will leave Luna with a fresh complication. Luna won't indeed know whose baby it is, much lower how to explain to RJ what happened with Zend. BNB spoilers, Lee Finnegan's intervention? It's possible that Luna starts to feel nauseated and assumes she has a stomach contagion. Luna might end up at the sanitarium. Luna might assume she'll get an arbitrary croaker. Or indeed John Finn Finnegan, it's quite possible that Lee weigh in and tells Luna she's not sick, but pregnant. Since Lee seems so convinced that Poppy is a gold digger like her mama, could Saint Finnegan prompt the youthful woman to get in revocation? Lee might reason to Luna that it's the only way not to destroy the Forrester family. Under normal circumstances, Luna presumably wouldn't hear to Lee's advice still, Luna might feel she has no choice, especially since she makes an unsupportable choice at the end of the week. Flashback, cleaner time isn't the same as real time. Eric's recovery after the afterlife was a little over a week in our time, but it had actually been months in the BMB macrocosm. So, if Luna ends up pregnant veritably snappily, keep the cleaner time in mind. Eric encourages Zend, RJ worries, Luna learns the truth. The bold and the beautiful spoilers for Wednesday, February 14, 2024, indicate that Luna Nozawa cries on Poppy Nozawa's shoulders over sleeping with Zend Forrester. RJ Forrester is upset about Luna since she is end acting like herself. Brooke Logan feels that Luna is okay with her mama. Zend is still worried over what happened with Luna. Eric Forrester arrives and asks what's wrong. The bold and the beautiful recap, Eric Forrester encourages Zend Forrester Eric was outside and wanted to check on Zend. Eric and Zend bandy the marriage. Eric says Zend looks a little down and asks what's wrong. BNB Recap Wednesday, February 14th Eric encourages Zend, RJ worries, Luna learns the truth Eric asks Zend if he'd a good time last night. Zend said pulling that off was enough badass. Eric feels enough good these days. Eric suggests that Zend needs a leftover cure. Eric is glad there were no big slip-ups last night. Eric says that's what love can do. Eric is surprised that Zen didn't bring anyone last night. Zen was more concerned about being with Eric. Eric talks to Zen about chancing someone special. 
Eric says that woman is out there for Zen. Eric talks about how lucky he has been. Zen says marriage really suits Eric. Eric says having this new woman is icing on the cutlet. Eric knows when Zen finds the right woman he knows he'll make her happy. Also read, BMB spoilers RJ upset when Luna did end come home, Brooke assures him of Luna's commitment BMB recap, Brooke Logan listens to RJ Forrester's Enterprises the Bold and the Beautiful spoilers reveal that Brooke asks if RJ and Luna argued last night. RJ says Luna was and worried at all. Brooke tells RJ that Luna has her other to take care of her and a mama's love is always the stylish drug. RJ misses seeing Luna first thing in the morning. RJ says Luna always textbooks him the first effects every morning. Brooke cannot believe Luna and RJ met as she and Ridge Forrester did. Brooke hopes that Luna and RJ have an easier time than they did. RJ cannot imagine what could have upset Luna. RJ says they're the most compatible couple. RJ wants to avoid all of the drama, if possible. RJ wants to tone down the drama a little bit. RJ has no way had this connection with a woman ahead. RJ trusts Luna fully. The bold and the beautiful recap, Poppy Nozawa tells Luna Nozawa about the mints Luna continues to question how she could cheat on RJ. Poppy asks Luna to forgive her. Luna asks what she's talking about. Also read, the bold and the beautiful spoilers Bill Spencer fights for Poppy's love Luna does end understand how Poppy could conceivably be to condemn for what happened last night. Poppy wants to talk about what happened last night. Luna tells her mama about going into the guest room and getting a bottle of water. Luna says it was like she was hallucinating. Luna had a couple of drinks and veritably little to eat. Luna asks her mama why this happened. Luna swears it was RJ's face she saw. Luna says no bone. At the Forrester house would medicine her. Poppy asks about the mints. Poppy finds her mints in Luna's bag. Luna has no idea what Poppy is freaking out about. Poppy tells Luna about the mints and how she allowed. They were inoffensive. Poppy explains that her mints aren't regular mints. Poppy says this is all her fault. Luna asks Poppy what she's talking about. Luna cannot believe she got cured by Poppy. Luna's consummation, Poppy's guilt, Zen's chance. Luna is veritably understandably worried over this, because she'd have no way ended up in Zen's bed if it was end for her mama's mints. Poppy knew she was popping these mints for anxiety and that they were a type of medicine. Unfortunately, Poppy no way bothered to enlighten her son on her conduct. Poppy should have been more careful with those medicines so they did end end up in anyone additional's hands, especially her daughters. Will Luna ever look at her mama the same again? Poppy Nozawa could have averted this the bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that Poppy realized enough snappily that her mints were gone. Luna had no idea that they were, but a heads up from her mama not to mix them up would have been nice. After all, how could Poppy not know how bad Luna was about using mints herself? Poppy should have allowed to offer a warning when she set up the missing. Poppy is veritably sorry about what he has caused, but that doesn't change the fact that Luna ended up in another man's bed because of him. How can Poppy ever make this up to her son? How can Luna face RJ after everything that has happened? Will RJ forgive Luna when the verity eventually comes out? Will Luna indeed tell RJ about it? BMB Spoilers Update Thursday, February 15th Luna's Consummation, Poppy's Guilt, Zen's Chance BNB Spoilers Eric Forrester has a new opportunity for Zen Zend Aloud. He'd everything he wanted when he set up Luna in his bed. Still, Zen should have known that commodity was wrong with her. Luna was acting strangely at the party, but it seems no bone. Noticed. Zen knew that Luna was with RJ and should have no way touched her. Zend knew RJ and Luna had no problems, why would he suppose she was there for him? Eric stopped by to check on Zend and will offer him an amazing occasion. Will Eric offer Zend a chance to design with him again, or does he offer to shoot Zend nearly differently to design for a while? Could Eric pick up on the fact that Zend has a thing for Luna and shoot him down so that he doesn't beget problems?